What's going on, brothers? It's Lime Techno the name. Got a video for you. It's written title Hide Your Success, Part 3. Here goes. So, I was sitting here enjoying my lovely evening during this Passover. And there was an article that was brought to my attention by one of the these MGTOW content providers where a man was shot during a robbery attempt by a female who was using these dating apps as a means to search for victims. And there you have it. So, not only are these trollops using dating apps to extract resources out of men, they're also using them to set men up to be robbed. Now, this has been going on for quite some time, but at this point, I believe it's increasing because a lot of trollops nowadays are entitled, they're desperate, they feel that your resources belong to her because patriarchy, misogyny, or whatever the goddamn cliche is. So, I'm going to say it like this, brothers. If you are financially robust, if you are living life, if you are not settle with any kind of trials, tribulations, and you have peace and tranquility, do a smart thing and hide your success. That's right, brothers. Hide your success. If these trollops and these blood and vermin don't do what you have it, then you won't be an easy target. I mean, it is what it is. I mean... I shouldn't be hearing stories like this. I mean, the last time I heard something like this was from TJ Sotomayor's channel a few years ago where some Cleon bitch had set up a man to be robbed. And she did this to get tickets to a rap concert. And I think her dumb ass is sitting in prison right now for doing that. But these trials, these clowns are getting more desperate. They're getting, getting greedier. And thanks to trash like Cardi B, they're doing whatever they can to secure the bag. Which means they're going on dating sites and they're setting up men to be robbed and murdered. Or just straight up robbed. Anything they do to get that bag. And they're also doing anything for clout. To them, they're shameless, they're lawless, and they're telling you by their actions. Their actions reflect their character. They're telling you that they're lawless. That's why you need to hide your success. Me? I don't wear a thousand dollar monkey suits in public. Me, I dress casual. I don't sit up here and peacock for these trollops or try to make somebody jealous. And for you uh, idiots out there who are, are dying in debt to keep up an image, you guys are a fucking joke. You're a joke without a punchline. The trollops know it. And even the people that you're trying to make jealous know that. And you do realize that you guys are soft targets. These feminists, these Cleon bitches, these trolls, they don't care anymore. If you put out this image that you are taking, they're going to go above and beyond to ruin your life. Or set you up to be robbed or murdered. They don't care anymore. You see, they've removed the shame, the guilt 
from the trash bag behavior. And right now, things like robbery, murder, fraud, usury, that's being removed also. It's societally, it is acceptable for them to set you up to be robbed and murdered, to secure the bag, do anything for clout. You guys should wake the fuck up, man. It's serious out there. That's why you need to hide your success. I mean, hell, where I'm at, I'm at peace. I can enjoy this place without trap interference. And I can hide my success. That's actually, I've been doing that long before I came across MGTOW and SYSBM. See now, SYSBM, they encourage you to hide your success, hence when they tell you to put yourself in a situation to make some safety and advantage. You can dress to impress sometimes, but don't just sit up here and wear like a thousand dollar monkey suit. Don't do that. You need to be more discreet. You need to be cognizant of what's going on out here. It's not summer yet, but all this shit is happening right now. Summer's going to get worse. It's going to be a lot worse. That's why you brothers need to hide your success and protect yourself at all times. Okay. Now, a lot of these bitch-made simps are not going to get this message because a lot of them are soft in the head, a lot of them are thirsty for pussy, and they don't learn. And Undertaker is okay with that. <laughs> it is what it is. Now, me, I take my personal safety seriously. Now, I know one of the, I know that uh, on my channel, one of these jokers says something like. Uh, lion, you need to watch out for those snakes. Let me, let me explain something to you. I don't really have to watch out for snakes because I got, I got it taken care of. And if the snakes get any bigger, I got something for them too. And I don't miss. <laughs> I'm telling you, brothers, hide your success and protect yourselves during these perilous times. It is what it is. Mm-hmm. This is a line of MGTOW. That's all I got. If you like the video, like badass scenery in the commentary, feel free to subscribe. If you want to join me, visit my channel. You can find the tip jar on the upper right side of the screen. That's the G Plus icon. All right, fam. All right, brethren. You know drill, you know drink only. Then we, it's watch PM. As for these Cleon bitches, these feminists, and these psychotic malcontents who will rob... Men on dating sites and do anything for clout, do anything to secure the bag, give them nothing. This is been MGTOW PSA. Welcome, sit tight. See you soon.